Tonight we're gonna make um, some egg rolls, shrimp egg rolls. And we're gonna start off by cooking the filling, and we're gonna start off with maybe about a teaspoon of vegetable oil into a hot cast iron pan. To that, we're gonna add about a teaspoon of sesame oil. Now we have about four cups of cabbage that we're gonna add into this that I've just julienned up. And it's gonna look like a lot of cabbage in the pan at first, but it's gonna cook way down. You can add whatever vegetables um, you want in here. You can add bean sprouts, bamboo shoots, uh, what have you, peas, whatever. Um, the only thing I'm gonna, the only other thing I'm gonna add into this. Uh, vegetable wise, and just a little bit of carrots. Um, I'm gonna add in about a half a cup of carrots. I just sliced up real thin. About a tablespoon of dehydrated onion. About a teaspoon of salt. A teaspoon of pepper. And about a tablespoon of garlic. Now I'm gonna add in about a teaspoon of soy sauce. Now once the cabbage is wilted down, I'm, I'm going to add in about a quarter pound of small shrimp and just cook these just until they're done and then we're going to set this mixture aside and let it cool before we fill our egg rolls. All right, now we're gonna do a real quick fried rice uh, to go along with our egg rolls. And I'm just gonna use a little dried minced onion here. Tonight is, I don't feel like cutting up an onion. So just, I don't know, use a teaspoon, a teaspoon of garlic. Just remember, if you always cook your eggs separately, and then um, take them out and then add them in once your rice is scrambled or once your rice is cooking you won't have big clumps of egg in your fried rice We're going to add about a teaspoon of sesame oil to the pan for the fried rice. And then add in about, eh, I don't know, about three cups of day old rice. Add in a couple, a couple teaspoons of soy sauce. Now we add in some mixed vegetables and our scrambled eggs back in here. And there you have it. Some vegetable fried rice to go along with our egg rolls. All right, now to make the Chinese mustard for our egg rolls. And uh, for those of you that don't, that don't know how simple this is, what we have here is two teaspoons of dried mustard, just your average ordinary dried mustard. And we're gonna add in a little bit of water at a time and give this a mix. And that's gonna be it. I mean, that's all there is to Chinese mustard. 
So it's probably like a two to one ratio, two, take, two teaspoons of um, the dried mustard to a teaspoon of water. Just, you know, just mix it until it's got a, until it thickens up real quick. It'll thicken up real quick. And it won't be really pungent right away after it sits for about 15 or 20 minutes. It'll be just as hot and spicy as Chinese mustard you get out of those little packets or you get from the Chinese restaurant. All right, now it's, time, it's finally time to do up our egg rolls here. So we have one egg roll wrapper. And we're going to do this the easy way with our hands. And put in a couple tablespoons of our mixture. And a couple shrimp. Let's do three shrimp per egg roll. All right, and now we're just going to roll this over and pull it tight and wrap our edges over like this like this roll it over again just make sure you get all your corners in you don't want these things to fill up with grease and then you can take your egg wash over here it's out of the picture and um, just paint the corners just give it a nice little seal and then roll it up Continue the process. Say about three shrimp per egg roll. <clears throat> and then you roll it up. Roll it over. Oops. Roll it over. Fold it over. Keep the shrimp in there. Keep the filling in there. Should have cut these shrimp up a little bit, but they'll be all right. Roll it over, and then you hold everything tight, and roll it over one more time, and then you paint it with your egg wash. And that'll give it a seal and keep these things from filling up with oil. All right, there we go. All our egg rolls are done, and now we're just going to go ahead and heat up the oil, and we'll be ready to cook them. All right, so we got our oil at about 375 degrees. We're going to go ahead and fry these real quick. All right, there we go. Our egg rolls are done, and let's go ahead and get this plated up. All right, there's our egg rolls and our fried rice. Let's go ahead and put a little bit of mustard on the plate here. Right, let's go ahead and just put it on the egg rolls. All right, so let's give these a try real quick. Whoa. Hot mama. Mmm. Oh, yeah. Mmm. <clears throat> mmm. Delicious. I figure an egg roll is about three bites worth. So that way you get a shrimp in every bite. Three shrimp per egg roll, and you're done. Well, I'm going to take one more bite here. Mm. Right. <coughs> and mustard is potent. <coughs> Woo! Mm. Well, I'm gonna take the last bite here in a minute. Thank you guys very much for watching, and we'll see you next time.